This is Bobby, also known as Bobs. He's six and a half years old, likes swimming and tennis balls, and I had borrowed him for a day out. Because of his love of water, I thought Bobs would enjoy a bit of stand-up paddleboarding here at Yarwell Mill Country Park near Peterborough. He wasn't that keen at first. It's working well so far. But after a while, I think he really started to enjoy the sights and smells of the River Neen. Our instructor was Dan Wallace. He runs Adventure Rutland, which organises outdoor activities. And in August, he'll be offering paddleboard sessions for dogs and their owners. I'm trying it over the summer to see how popular it is. And then uh, down the line, it might be where we do more regular meets. He brought his Labrador Maggie, who was making Dan's job a bit harder by chasing the paddle. I think once they've like, actually got into the water, they see what it's all about, they calm down a little bit, uh, they, they kind of become at ease. Uh, and they, after a while, they start to enjoy it. Um, and uh, I just think it's such a nice way to uh, take your, you know, your man's best friend onto the water and have a great time. We'd also been joined by Amanda Markham, who lives at Yarwell with her dog, Violet. It's lovely. It's just bonding time with the dog. Um, she, she, she gets out, loves it. We can have a look around at the countryside and you just see so much the wildlife and there's, there's birds out here and the swans. So, yeah, it's really lovely. After the adventure of paddleboarding, Bob's and I headed off to try a more sedate water sport. It's nice, isn't it? A swan pedalo at Neen Park in Peterborough. The park is another very dog-friendly place to visit. Fantastic place for dog walkers. In fact, um, dog walkers are one of our main user groups and we've invested over £150,000 in the park recently, both in dog agility areas, also covered areas at our cafes. Um, for those who are more adventurous, uh, then we've got our rural estate where you can go out and, and walk in the, some fantastic countryside. Uh, and for those other people that uh, perhaps want to take their um, recreation with their, with their um, dogs to the next level, then we've got all sorts of water sports activities which uh, uh, dogs can also get involved in if they'd like to. In the end though, nothing could quite match Bob's enjoyment of his favourite pastime. Stuart Leith's ITV News, Peterborough.